Hello everyone, this is Andre at Simwell. In this video, we will show you a supply chain simulation model, which was built using the powerful data-driven tools in the Arena software. In this supply chain, we have five supplier locations in which 10 different trucks will be picking up material, which can be delivered to 100 different customers. Surprisingly, only 70 modules are required to build a mod model like this one. And the logic is pretty straightforward. And it's important to note that animation is not mandatory in Arena. So it is completely possible to build a model like this and avoid spending time on animation and to verify and validate it only by debugging and by looking at outputs and results. In this case, we have built an animation just to be able to better demonstrate the behavior of this model in this uh, video. So on this map, you see five different supplier sites and the 100 customer sites and the truckloads of material being generated to the supplier sites and being delivered to the required customers. We will now spend some time better understanding the logic behind this model. So there's a section where material to be delivered is created. There's an initialization for the 10 trucks. And of course, there is some logic for picking up truckloads at suppliers and then routing to customers and delivering the products. We will now remove some of this finished logic so we can rebuild it for you. Okay, so first we have removed the set of stations for customers. So we have a set of stations for suppliers here with the five suppliers, and we will rebuild the set for customers together. So basically we do this and we use Excel to create the names for each of the stations. go. So next we will create the objects that we need to store the truckloads that are waiting to be picked up at the five supplier sites. So we will create a set of five queues. So we can use Excel to generate our queue names, which are basically just numbers like this. We can generate the queues here and create the set in the advanced process panel. We can copy the name here. Now that set of queues will be used in a hold module. So we will add it here. Hold truckloads to be picked up. And it's an infinite hold because the truckloads will be sitting there until the truck actually goes to pick them up. And we will choose our set of inventory and store in the index of the supplier the truckload. Next, when we reach the supplier site with the truck, we need to make sure that there is at least one truckload to be picked up before we try to pick it up. And this will be done using a whole module with the can for condition type. Hold until truckload to pick up that supplier. And the condition will be to check if at, in the queue for the current inventory at, at the current supplier, if there is space for, if there's at least one truckload uh, stored. So number in queue higher than zero for our set here. at the index supplier ID. And we will store our trucks waiting in another set of queues which I have already created. Go. The next step is to actually pick up the entity of the truckload. So we will use the pickup module here. 
picked up truckload. We want to pick up one, the first in the queue. And the queue is the inventory at supplier. And we will be looking at the queue with the current supplier ID for our truck. So since we pick up the truckload, we also need to drop it off once we reach the customer site. So we can use the drop off module right here and keep all of the, the original attributes and just dispose this um, truckload. And the last step to, to be done is to create the route to go from the supplier station to the customer station. The time it'll take to travel between these two locations is stored in the variables array that we have created. It's the travel times matrix, and it has 100 rows for the customers and five columns for the suppliers, and it contains hours value. So here we route to customer, and we will use that matrix with the current customer ID we are delivering to and the current supplier ID we are going starting from. And the station we are heading to is the set taken to the set of customers here, customer ID. Here we go. Our model is now ready. Thank you for watching. Simwell is an Arena Premier partner. If you wish to download this model, go to simwell.ca slash supply. And remember, if you simulate, simwell.